Hi, my name is Luis Orozco from Music 309, and I did my research on how salsa is effective for keeping the elderly active in their homes, and I named it Movement of Salsa. Salsa is a form of social dancing that originated in Cuba that involves rigorous and flagrant movement of the entire body. One might not consider the benefits of this rhythmic dancing, especially in the elderly. This can in this cannot only include physically but mentally. This is probably one of the better activities that the elderly can do in their retirement homes compared to others, other things like bingo. This, is, this also applies to young people, but I'll be focusing on the elderly who don't move much. Salsa dancing's most basic move, which is the pull and push motion that is performed with a partner, is proven to be beneficial to the elderly in helping them move and be more active so they don't have to sit around all day. It makes you want to move and it's also a fun exercise compared to all the other things that the elderly do in a retirement home. I set out to research the benefits of salsa dancing because my parents named me after a famous salsa singer named Luis Enrique who is the one singing this song right here. Of course, Luis Enrique had enough of an impact on my parents to name me after him who I think is awesome. My name is Luis Enrique Orozco. And I'll mention several others with a huge impact too. This paper will contribute to health studies and activities conducted in retirement homes over others. This work is important because we all grow old and we all want to have the best possible treatment and activities available so we don't just sit around there waiting our last days out. I have several important articles that all came to the same conclusion that salsa dancing is super beneficial and fun to 90% of people. It doesn't even matter if they're good or not because if they don't know how to dance, they can have an opportunity to try and learn. And if, they have, if they're already salsa gods, then they'll have a blast. Salsa, this is some history on salsa. Salsa is a popular form of social dancing, form of social dance that originated in the Caribbean. The movements of salsa have origins in Puerto Rican, Bomba, and Peña. Cuban Sun, Cha Cha Cha, Mambo, and other dance forms. The dance, along with the music, along with the salsa music, originated in mid 1970s in New York. Different regions of Latin America and United States have distinct salsa styles of their own, such as Cuban, Puerto Rican, Cali, Colombia, LA, and New York styles. Salsa dance socials are commonly held in nightclubs, bars, ballrooms, restaurants, and outside, especially when part of an outdoor festival. As through with many of the dances, salsa went through several variations through the years and have, and there have been several speculations on how the name salsa came to be. Some say that it is because of how, how the people who made the music was actually a bunch of cultures mixed together. Some others say it's because of the spicy and hot connotations of the word salsa. Other than Luis Enrique, there are several influential salsa singers, which include Celia Cruz, who sang La Vida es un Carnaval, Mark Anthony, who we all know and love, who wrote Vivir Mi Vida, and Joe Arroyo, who sang La, Re Re La Rebellion, just to name a few. All these artists and their songs are over 20 years old, yet they're, they're, yet they're still the go-to songs at every Latino festival because they're the timeless classics that everyone loves. For my ethnomusic ethnomusicological theme, I'm gonna give you a couple reasons why so it's good for elderly. One reason is because salsa dancing is healthy for the elderly and, it's, and it helps keep the joints lubricated. This helps prevent a disease called osteoporosis in both men and women and since it keeps the joints lubricated it also prevents a very common disease in the elderly named arthritis. Another reason is because it helps you, you can lose a lot of weight dancing. You can lose a, up to as much as 393 calories an hour dancing salsa. And so in conclusion, um, salsa dancing is fun and you could dance it at any age but it, it's very beneficial and we should add it to um, retirement homes. And we also have a club here at CSUN if you want to join too. Thank you. Goodbye.